Welcome to my studio. I really love painting landscapes with mountains in that I kind of make up in my head. And uh, it's normally inspired by somewhere I've been, um, a place I've visited, but um, I try not to use photographs. Um, I just kind of go with it, um, with the layout of it and just see what happens on the canvas. This one was um, <clears throat> one I did when I was thinking about a place that I visited in New Zealand many years ago. Um, it's just dreamy and lots of uh, distance with um, <clears throat> nothing in between. So it was very remote and it was quite daunting knowing that we had to get from sort of here to right across here in a little car. So it was, uh, and it was an experience and I've uh, kind of tried to capture that in this painting. <laughs> I'm just finishing off this one, um, which I've kept back for a few weeks um, to let dry because it's done in oil and I didn't want to do any more to it because I have a habit of f not quite finishing them and then coming back to it a few weeks later and just adding some more bits and pieces to it that perhaps I didn't notice before. Lighting is something that I really enjoy doing. I think it's really important to um, put lighting into your painting to give it some depth. Maybe that's just me. Um, I don't know if I could do a painting where I didn't do that. I'd find it really hard to not resist trying to put some highlights in somewhere. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All uh, right. Okay. Right. Um, this is an oil painting that I'm working on that I um, used ice to inspire me to create a sort of a landscape um, effect. Um, for me it's really unique. Um, I haven't um, seen a landscape or something that's inspired me. It's purely um, how ice can form around certain things that are frozen in it. And to me this looks very much like a branch um, that's been frozen and captured either at the edge of a waterfall um, or in a lake that's been frozen where the limbs are actually sticking down into the ice. That's what I see. Um, it's really interesting to hear other people's points of view because some, be, some people say, oh, it looks like this, and I've never seen it myself, but when they say it, I can really see it. I really love creating these things where people have different opinions, and um, I'm interested to hear what you think this reminds you of. Thank you. I have absolutely no idea what this one is. Um, I know that this looks a bit like an eye, but it's actually um, a semi-precious gemstone called... Turquoise! <laughs> 